Hello, everyone. Thank you for my talk. Uh, not uh, not for the lunch. <laughs> It's lunch time. Uh, today we will share about some research about the uh, attacking Microsoft .NET framework to the CLR. And uh, let's introduce ourselves. Uh, this is Jason uh, Shikang. He's a security researcher from the 360 team. And uh, he's a lead author of this paper. And th this is his uh, email address. And I'm Red Ring, Yu Hong. <laughs> I'm also from the 360 uh, team. Uh, and uh, I also gave some talk on uh, uh, hacking the box last year, and uh, HitCon, RexCon, uh, XCon4, SysCon360, uh, and I'm also the member of uh, Light for Freedom. And this is my website. I often give some papers on my, uh, submit some paper on my website. Yeah. And uh, this is our team. Uh, the 360 cert. Uh, our team is created uh, May last year. Uh, we are a young team and a powerful team. We focus on some uh, emergency uh, uh, emergency uh, for the cyberspace upstream, and uh, we also focus on the malware analyzing, uh, trade hunting, and the botnet uh, botnet tracking. And uh, this is our team uh, website. Okay, <coughs> this agenda. Uh, first, uh, we will introduce some basic of .NET framework and CRR. Uh, the core point is uh, uh, MSI code, and some points we're interested in as a possible weakness. And then we will review some uh, security issues for CRR before. And uh, we uh, and we can learn from the history uh, history study. Uh, we will introduce the VSTO weakness and show some effect uh, about the VSTO attack in the real world. Uh, last but least, uh, we will introduce the fuzzy mode about CRR and how can we find more bugs from CRR security research. Okay, first, uh, the .NET framework and CRR. Uh, this is my turn. Uh, first, the .NET framework uh, provides a runtime environment called the Common Language Runtime, uh, which runs the code and uh, provides service uh, that makes the development process easier. And uh, compilers and tools uh, expose the Common Language Runtimes uh, functionality uh, and uh, enable you to write code to benefit from this match execution environment. Uh, for example, just like uh, you can translate uh, one language to another language. Uh, this is uh, uh, match code and metadata. Uh, and uh, uh, in the translation, uh, the information is called the uh, metadata uh, to help the uh, components to uh, interact si seamlessly. And uh, when you write a code using a high-level language on top of the .NET, uh, such as uh, C Sharp, VB, and F Sharp, uh, such as uh, these languages, uh, uh, in the compiler, we'll create a intermediate language. Uh, in the uh, intermediate language, uh, which calls the uh, uh, MSIL. Uh, it is uh, Microsoft uh, Intermediate Language, MSIL. Uh, yep. And uh, uh, it's a basic context about the metadata. Uh, metadata is stored in one section of the .NET Framework PE file, and another section uh, is uh, for the MSIL. Uh, so the first section is for metadata. The another, sec uh, the another section is for MSIL. Uh, and uh, the metadata, uh, po uh, metadata portion uh, to the file contains a uh, uh, series of table and help data structures. 
the MSI also introduce uh, also include the uh, metadata tokens. Uh, the metadata tokens uh, refines the metadata portion of the PE file. Uh, for example, you might uh, encounter uh, metadata tokens uh, when you use MSIL uh, decompiler, uh, such as a tool uh, named the LLDAMS. Uh, this is a decompiler tool. Uh, when you use the uh, decompiler tool, you will see the MSIL, uh, such as uh, uh, just like the uh, red image. This is the uh, IL code. And uh, after compiling, uh, the type information is saved as uh, metadata in PE format uh, in PE file. Uh, Donet uh, is based on uh, object. Uh, oriented. So there's some uh, important object in this. Uh, uh, the image shows us uh, all the object, uh, but I think uh, as a researcher we focus on some uh, important, uh, we're interested in some uh, object uh, in the left list. First, the uh, dev table. A uh, dev table uh, describes the uh, type and the member information uh, defined in the source code. And the second ref table. Uh, ref table refines uh, uh, elements can be uh, other modules uh, of the same uh, uh, assembly uh, or the different assemblies. And the second pointer, a pointer is just a pointer. And uh, uh, the last uh, help, uh, the help is a common uh, language in the, uh, is a uh, common knowledge. Uh, in the security, just as a help, oh, okay. And uh, for uh, uh, metadata tokens, in a whole metadata tokens, uh, each row uh, of the uh, each row of each metadata uh, metadata table uh, is defined uh, is uh, identified uh, the uh, MSI portion of the PE file. Uh, by the metadata tokens. The metadata tokens uh, is include uh, just, a, uh, uh, just, uh, just include the four bytes, four bytes. Uh, the top bytes defines the uh, modular and uh, uh, tab refer. And uh, the other uh, bytes uh, define the rows in the metadata table uh, that uh, the uh, programming uh, uh, animates the being, uh, no, no, no. Uh, <laughs> uh, the first the first byte uh, is in the uh, def defines the modular and the type refer, and the others uh, define the uh, method. Uh, if you, you, you if you if you write the method in C sharp uh, or as a uh, high level language uh, in the uh, uh, in the com in the compiling in the compiling uh, the p file uh, the other rows uh, will follow in the uh, metadata token and the uh, MSI portion and this is the other rows uh, for example you can see the left image as a address uh, for example, the ZX, uh, uh, oh, uh, uh, 0x, 06, 0, 0, 0. Uh, and the top byte, the 0x06, uh, it's, uh, uh, it's include the uh, metadata uh, method def method. It's include the metadata method. And uh, the lower and the lower bytes, the other bytes, uh, tells the uh, common language runtime to look in the uh, fourth uh, to look in the fourth rows and uh, uh, to describe the method definitions. This is the uh, uh, first rows and the other rows. 
in the metadata token. Uh, and uh, it's a, a magic code. Uh, as I said before, uh, when we write a program, program in a .NET high-level language, uh, the compiler uh, will translate uh, this code into a uh, immediate language. Uh, this immediate language is MSIL code. And uh, uh, you can see the uh, exam uh, in the uh, image. Uh, this is the exam MSIL code of the C hello HITB. And uh, we can see the reverse result. This is the reverse result for the IL code. Mm. So the next page. Uh, you know, the uh, operating system and the runtime environment uh, provide some uh, process to load the uh, program. Uh, but in the donut, in the donut, uh, it, it includes the hosting program and uh, the non-hosting program. Maybe, may, maybe translate it in the English. It's ho hosting program and non-hosting program. And, uh, uh, and, uh, uh, not, uh, not just, uh, one process load only one program. One process can load uh, many uh, program. The many program is in the application domain. Uh, is in the application domain. Application domains provide a uh, security protection for the uh, whole uh, process. And uh, uh, in this process, in this loading process, the manager, the manager is CLR. The CLR manage the whole process in the loading. And uh, mm, uh, as I said, the the program uh, includes the hosting program and the non-hosting program. Uh, the uh, in order to manage the application domain, uh, the CRR will manage it. This process is called uh, CRR hosting. CRR hosting. Uh, so uh, this is the primer of the .NET and the CRR. Uh, sorry for my rubbish spoken English. <laughs> And <laughs> uh, if you can uh, uh, understand clearly of my accent, you can break me uh, in any time, okay? Okay, the next part is my colleague Shrikant's job. And uh, this is his first time in the conference to share the research in English. <laughs> so, okay, this is his, his turn. Oh, mm, hello, everyone. I'm Shi Kang, and I will continue this part. Uh, in China, we have a slang, Wing Guo Er Zixin. It means that we can learn, know when we will uh, reveal the uh, prior uh, knowledge. It is same for the uh, researcher. Uh, when we will want to find a new bug, uh, we usually reveal the old. Uh, there are uh, there are three um, points uh, that a typical uh, MSR interaction, uh, UAC bypassing, and uh, uh, SQI will CR. Uh, uh, for MSR uh, interaction, we have three methods to do. Uh, in order to interaction uh, our code, uh, what we want. Uh, first, we will figure out. Uh, of the process of the R code completing and execution. As Radrin said before, R code is uh, uh, coming by higher level uh, language, took over by CRR. And CRR will load it and uh, uh, translate it uh, 
into the machine language. Uh, so we we'll just uh, need to uh, control the uh, CLR loading or uh, higher level language translating. Uh, the first and the second both uh, belong to had a uh, mode file. Uh, well, we study, we, st uh, we find the uh, CRR provide a uh, method to uh, make file create uh, as a simply and, uh, and a new one table or message into loaded uh, uh, assembly. It is called uh, profiling. Uh, so, uh, so, uh, so we'll have the uh, software. Uh, plan A is a uh, hooking uh, complete method as a uh, program enter, uh, and uh, and replace uh, our code uh, what we want to to be executed by the really complete method counting, uh, because uh, complete method execution because is uh, uh, object is a uh, uh, method, uh, so we will uh, so we will know where is the uh, we uh, inject. Uh, this is an uh, example for. Uh, uh, for uh, finding injection message, and then uh, and then coming aid CRR will call uh, a common message. Uh, we can replace the common message through easy hook. Uh, and now we uh, we need to replace our code before the complete message called and uh, restore the program execute uh, execution status. Uh, also we uh, we can make for uh, minimal uh, threads for different uh, .NET uh, version is the uh, code is uh, not uh, uh, unified. Uh, so uh, made for uh, uh, made, made this uh, disk uh, reset provides a uh, uh, well uh, well to uh, made field. and we can uh, find the reset address through PDB of the same server. Uh, and then uh, and then we'll need to uh, add our code. Into a complete method, it is in order to res, uh, reset the method decor, uh, uh, method uh, disk to projected. There will be complete, uh, complete uh, well fashion calling. However, there is a limited uh, in this plan. If someone, uh, if someone method would not uh, be called, because when we can lock in the uh, method name. Through get a uh, get a message fashion. This is a uh, this is a possible uh, uh, possible uh, by Fairco magazine. Uh, compared to Plan A, Fairco uh, use a, a technology called uh, called template to jump to the uh, special uh, dynamic uh, message uh, message. Uh, uh, therefore, the uh, flexibility of the Plan B is greater improved. It's a uh, mm, physical use uh, uh, temporal is inst instant temporal at the beginning of the code, and uh, use uh, temporal is uh, defined a uh, 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 dynamical method uh, that will we have the special method secret. Uh, uh, and last uh, and last end represent uh, um, uh, um, uh, assembly. Uh, in the last page. Uh, the plan B is uh, proposed by the Fracker, uh magazine, uh, and uh, uh, this solves the problem uh, in the plan A way doesn't solve. Uh, just uh, he can uh, install uh, install a uh, uh, tramply in the beginning of the code, so uh, the attacker can uh, call the Dominic. Uh, <laughs> yep, the dynamic uh, function. Uh, this is more. Uh, this is more. Uh, the, 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 this plan, the uh, plan B is better than plan A. The plan, the plan A is uh, have some limit. So uh, the plan A can't uh, call the dynamic method. Okay. Mm, and the last plan we find is uh, where we write the status. Uh, when there are lots of classes and uh, execution, it could, uh, it, could, uh, it could be increased by um, providing API and uh, uh, modify our code before just uh Actually, the issue of uh, 
uh, insertion of profiling injection is set up a uh, uh, profiler deal. It is connected to uh, connected to CRR by a query profiler callback and uh, a query profiler info. Uh, it uh, and uh, and last uh, you, uh, uh, user can insert a uh, customized function into our code before uh, GRT camping. Uh, first, we need to gain. Uh, get the uh, slot of uh, injection po uh, position. This is uh, uh, GRT compilation started. And we need uh, to pass two uh, parameter, uh, function ID and uh, fly, uh, fly, uh, fly safe block. Uh, block. Uh, and then we need to get a function uh, body. This first uh, function is uh, get a R function body. This uh, there are two par uh, parameter. Uh, parameter, uh, parameter model, uh, model ID and uh, message, uh, message ID, and it's uh, well rendered to a pointer buttons. Uh, the second function is uh, set our code, uh, uh, set uh, set our uh, function body. Uh, in a, uh, in was the first function is in the order to gain the uh, thrust of the arm function, and the second is go to. Uh, go to uh, modify the uh, M fashion, and because there is some uh, security uh, production in CRR via JRT compilation, uh, we need to find some uh, points in the work. Uh, first, uh, first is head. Head is uh, have uh, has a uh, code size and uh, set header. Uh, uh, second, pro, uh, second is pro, uh, program uh, status. Uh, it has a uh, uh, static have a uh, pro parameter and a renter renter address. Uh, uh, when when uh, when a manager uh, process process application or uh, services uh, starts, it's lost the uh, company language return. Uh, when the CRR is uh, a ring, he is uh, uh, should the environment uh, uh, variable. Uh, to, de uh, to decide it, whether the process should uh, connect to uh, connect to a uh, provider. Uh, uh, car able uh, providing and the and the car pro uh, car provider. If the car able provider uh, providing ching pass, the CRR connects the uh, provider. That is the uh, uh, class ID uh, uh, or um, program ID. Uh, which must uh, uh, with uh, which must have been a surrender is proper in the registry. Uh, the prof uh, the profiler uh, CRR application you must uh, set it, uh, set the credible profiling and uh, credible a uh, credible uh, uh, profiler uh, environment variable uh, variable uh, before you run the application you must uh, also Make sure this uh, pro, uh, profiler deal is a uh, registered. Registered. Uh, uh, registered. And there is a compare of the uh, plan in the following table. Uh, we can uh, we can see we can see that uh, all of three wheels to inject. Plan B is the uh, best uh, choice. Uh, it can be uh, su uh, suitable in uh, most uh, 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 series. And uh, uh, invoke and any fashion you uh, you want you want to. Actually, we uh, we can do something interesting using MSR injection. For example, CR fuzz, UAC uh, bypassing, and uh, and more. Uh, there is a case. It's a uh, it is a different uh, between uh, donut and com rhythm. Uh, donut do, uh, doesn't uh, provide uh, pro, uh, process. Uh, 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 elevate, elevated uh, pro, uh, production will class ID. Uh, Donut framework, uh, Donut framework uh, can be uh, made uh, made to load uh, profiling deal uh, or com uh, component uh, component deal uh, will user uh, user user di uh, difference uh, environment uh, variable and class ID uh, regi uh, re registry uh, and uh, it can it can be explored to bypass using bypass the UA, uh, UAC in 
in different setting on uh, Windows Seven to Ten. Uh, in my mind, uh, the uh, uh, Microsoft doesn't consider the UAC bypassing is a vulnerability, but we also uh, give this example of the POC to show the uh, MSIL uh, injection to uh, do the UAC bypass. Uh, we have a, a simple demo video in the next page. Okay. Uh, in order to uh, make a, a donut application load on RDL. Uh, we need to set a environment with real body. In, in the in the reality, uh, act, uh, attacked. We just need to find an SQL spot uh, that is uh, until ele elevated, elevated, and uh, uh, and use uh, uh, donut CR to load our figure pro uh, profile deal. And I must say. Uh, it's great to to be the uh, as an example. Uh, in the case, uh, we uh, we use the uh, uh, J JP added uh, MMC, uh, not only MMC, and uh, there have other uh, usable uh, usable ones. And we and we and we will show the other in the demo video next page. Okay. And. Uh this is a simple video. Uh, first, this is uh, the POC. Uh, we show the next. Uh, we show the last page. Uh, just write to the PowerShell script, and uh, to run it. Uh, it is. It is in order to change the environment. And you can see. We run the who am I? The who am I is a system command, so the system uh, will not alert uh, uh, security a lot. So this is a simple video to show the uh, UEC bypassing was a profiling inject, uh, but the Microsoft doesn't think uh, the UEC bypass is a vulnerability. But this is common in the real world. You do some pen test. Yep. Um, and next part, uh, our our hacker no uh SQL injection, but less no attack uh attacking SQL server. We also are uh through this attack attack server surface as uh, uh extends many years. Here is a uh, uh basic uh basic uh payload. Uh, the uh, SQL Server interesting has uh, three part. Uh, first one is create a SQL Server project uh, via Visual Studio, uh, and create a procedure, and uh, and last uh, is uh, SQL Server uh, uh, load uh, loading like a Dell. Uh, and and let's uh, take a look at the uh, payload again. Uh, the first uh, one is create uh, create an uh, as assembly and uh, uh, try to load the uh, to load the Dell. There were well two wells uh, to uh, load the uh, load Dell in SQL Server. They are pass A and through fail uh, with a hex uh, hex uh, uh, hex uh, hex decode. Uh, obviously, uh, load fail with a uh, hex decode is better. Uh, next, uh, set up uh, set up payload uh, through Visual Studio just write a uh, uh, normal C sharp code and uh, complete it uh, into a uh, SQL Server project. And, they, uh, and here we'll get the SQL Server project, and we need to uh, has uh, the code. Uh, it's the uh, it's uh, it, uh, it's SQL, uh, SQL uh, script uh, is has. Uh, 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 the uh, procedure name is uh, uh, is uh, as in uh, Visual Studio project is uh, uh, class uh, class name, and uh, and this uh, uh, and this uh, as simply name is uh, uh, um, um is simply name is uh, fashion name. Uh, uh, last is uh, is called the assembly name. Uh, so and this is the result he, uh, he uh, executed as a 
uh, MS circle. Uh, he means uh, in this attack, uh, circle server uh, consult the uh, MSNSLI as a function name. So you just uh, need to uh, need to execute the function name, and the circle server will execution uh, the dial what you want. Mm, also, there are uh, there are uh, so in in this uh, attack, it's still easy to export. Uh, there are also must be uh, able on uh, uh, circle server is not uh, defined. Uh, however, we can uh, turn on, uh, turn on it use uh, one uh, circle uh, circle queer uh, use uh, uh, SP uh, configure fashion is to able it. Uh, and it's the second one is uh, and the uh, second one is uh, to throw the uh, trust uh, program uh, their uh, their account account uh, account uh, must have execution uh, permission uh, we could do uh, we can uh, we could do evaluation of the elevation elevation of uh, privilege by DBA to slow it and uh, you know in the real world pen testing uh, this is very common uh, that uh, xp cmd is uh, can be restored or the you uh, your uh, circle account is a uh, low level and uh, you can use this method this way to uh, execute uh, to to do execution uh, not through the xp CMD shell, and uh, you can do some elevator of the private leak uh, to do the uh, to 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 uh, lead to the DBA. Okay, this is the uh, two ways uh, in this attack you can do. And uh, we also uh, make a simple video. This is a. Uh, 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 the normal project you can write the uh, C, uh, no, no, normal C sharper, and uh, this is uh, uh, servo has a uh, uh, circle injection vulnerability. And this is load the Dell. You can see the circle serve have uh, loaded the Dell, and uh, we will reverse a shell. We want to reverse a shell. Okay, the shell is reversed. the IP address and the Vixen IP address. Maybe we will write a better uh, automate uh, to us, uh, such as uh, uh, circle map temper for just a commit uh, submit our temper to the uh, circle map project. And okay, <laughs> sorry for our poor English. <laughs> uh, maybe we will suggest Dylan. Eh, Dylan is not here. Maybe we will suggest Dylan to provide the translator in the future. <laughs> it is better to uh, share in the research. <laughs> maybe. Okay. Uh, the last part. Uh, the last part is mine. Uh, here I will introduce some. Um, interesting research mm. the, uh, by uh, restarting from the history. 
versus a VSTO, VSTO attack service. Uh, VSTO, you know, VSTO uh, uh, is a set of uh, development tools uh, by uh, uh, Visual Studio. Uh, and uh, Visual Studio will provide this uh, VSTO to create a, to create an add-in. Uh, this add-in can be uh, uh, can lo uh, can call the CLR to uh, expose their function, and uh, this allows extensions to the uh, office uh, office applications. Uh, to be written in a CRI compliant language, so you can you can just uh, think it uh, a normal documentation become a programming documentation. The documentation the documentation can execute the system code. Yep. Okay. Take uh, let's take a look. Uh, uh, sorry, this is a Chinese version. <laughs> <laughs> uh we can see the uh project uh VSTO uh VSTO uh can create uh Excel, InfoPass, Outlook, PowerPoint, Visual and Word. Uh all of these are uh, support the add-in, just uh, the extension. Uh not only the extension, not only the adding, uh, but also the Excel and Word. Excel can create a workbook. Word can create a document. So you can uh, choose the VSTO to create a single documentation file. And uh, also, Excel and uh, Word uh, support the uh, template. Uh, that means, uh, you know, the template and uh, extension, just like the add-in, uh, will load while uh, you open the Office application. If you, you just if you open the application, the add-in and the template will load. Yep. So as a hacker, you 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 can say you can. Choose this method to do a backdoor. Yep. Uh, and uh, uh, when we uh, when we create uh, this uh, uh, project, uh, we just uh, need to write a normal C sharp code in the document namespace. namespace. Uh, here, I I I write the hello uh, to using the message box to output hello. And uh, but there's uh two things we need to solve. The first uh, the create uh, 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 because the off office application will check the uh, if this documentation is legal or illegal. So when you first to open the uh, documentation, it will take this alert. And uh, this is the first one. And the second one, you, you will see, uh, when you uh, build the, a job and the compiling, after compiling, there's uh, uh, more remaining and mass uh, fire. In, uh, L, uh, uh, it's not else uh, the documentation single file. There's a many file. So these are uh, two problem we want to solve because no one will to click uh, with this many and mass file. Okay. So in order to solve this, uh, we will understand first understand the uh, why the uh, office application will alert why there's uh, uh, there are many mass files. We, we we will uh, understand this. The first one, uh, the office application when the first uh, when the first open when the first opening, 
the office will to search a special value in the registry. If uh, if the registry has the uh, tag has a special value, uh, the special value is uh, uh, load to uh, uh, is in order to load the add-in or load the template. So the first time you open, uh, it will search it. If it search it, okay, uh, check pass, and uh, uh, this alert is doesn't is is doesn't uh, is, this alert is missing. Uh, okay, but if uh, check for false, uh, there's uh, this alert. So this is the first one, and the second one, second one, the many mass file. The, the this is called the additional file. Uh, the additional file is must be here, but we have some trick to hide this. To use the uh, this command uh, to hide the uh, additional file. Uh, so um, in the whole uh, in the whole research, uh, we uh, understand the first uh, uh, we understand the first one and the second one. After that, uh, we have some. Uh, Attacking surface in the real world, and we try to, uh, and we try to, um, try to do this and show the effect of this attack. So, uh, we have two uh, attacking surface. The first one is uh, documentation fission, and the second is to do a backdoor. To do the backdoor is easy to understand. Uh, just uh, make a uh, adding extension or time later. Just uh, you 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 control someone's PC. You can do this one. Uh, the, the, this one to do your backdoor. And uh, uh, here we, we we will introduce the first one. The first one is more interesting. Uh, we count the documentation fashion. Uh, we cached by our EK landing. We have a system. Uh, the system can land some uh, exploit kit, and uh, uh, our system has a sandbox. Uh, we catch uh, the documentation fashion uh, in a month. Uh, the result, uh, sorry, the the image, uh, the image. Uh, I I have not changed to the English version. Uh, the result is uh, uh, in the documentation fashion, the uh, macro is uh, nearby the 60%, and the vulnerability exploit uh, nearby the uh, 36%, and the use some future and others nearby the uh, 5%. What is future? Just like the DDE. You know, uh, DDE and OLE. The DDE, DDE execution is popular last year, uh, and and Microsoft uh, provides some solution for this later. Okay, uh, but this is just uh, the result we catch and uh, we uh, analyze it. We find the uh, uh, we find uh, we find the uh, uh, we find uh, we find uh, uh, we find something that uh, macro is not the uh, most uh, higher highest uh, success successful method. Mac macro is not the highest uh, successful method, and uh, the exploit the vulnerabilities exploit. Uh, it's just so 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 it, because there are so many pieces install the uh, antivirus and the antivirus will uh, protect the uh, vulnerabilities protection. But the latest, the five percent futures, OLE and DDE, is uh, the most to uh, is the most easy to is the easiest. To uh, exploit in the 
real world. So we think uh, why? Uh, we think uh, we, uh, we think the reason is uh, the DD. Uh, for example, the DDE. The DDE uh, first is uh, uh, f uh, first one is uh, uh, not a uh, vulnerability. Is the future, and uh, so some uh, antivirus uh, will not uh, s uh, product uh, with the DDE, and the users. Uh, just uh, say uh, the DDE. What is DDE? I don't know. I, I just uh, I, I I'm just a user. Uh, okay, uh, you 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 want me click OK? Okay, click OK. Okay, I can I can see the documentations. <laughs> so uh, that's why I <laughs> that's why I think this is the most uh, uh, possible uh, in the result. And uh, and then uh, in order to research clearly. Uh, we put some phishing attack in a real world. Uh, just uh, 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 comparing uh, uh, with some the social in uh, social in, uh, in social engineering uh, attack, we create some phishing documentations named PUBG, uh, the 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 game, a PUBG map hacker, uh, or some uh, the the uh, the best hot girl just uh, <laughs> name that <laughs> and uh, some the file name you know <laughs> uh, and uh, uh, we create uh, the 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 code just uh, collect some information uh, in queries uh, such as the host name and IP we do not do some evil in the user's PC. Just uh, collect the, some uh, the, the, uh, some of this uh, incurious information, and uh, this is the result. Re the result is shocked. Uh, nearly the forty percent are hit. Nearly the forty percent are hit. So uh, maybe my name, uh, maybe my file name is. Uh, uh, easy to let the user to click this, such as the PUBG map hackers and the girl, whatever. <laughs> and uh, uh, this is a simple demo, just uh, the attacker and uh, recent. You can see we uh, we create the uh, documentation, and this is hidden the. Uh, mass fire uh, and hiding it just a uh, one single documentation file and uh, uh, pack the whole di uh, directory and send a mail to your uh, target send the mail and uh, the target check the mailbox uh, he got a file. Uh, he read the uh, email and he find ah uh, this uh, uh, attachment and download the attachment. The attachment is the uh, ZIP. Okay, un 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 unpack it. Unpack it. And uh, uh, go to the directory. This is the uh, uh, documentation. And this is a simple uh, demo in a, a real attack. Maybe the others uh, we hit. Uh, maybe just uh, do this. Uh, and uh, in this research, we get some result. The uh, micro uh, the micro fission is just. Uh, uh, Eleven percent to uh, uh fourteen percent success, and the DDE efficient is nearly to the uh thirty percent, but the VST efficient with hidden nearly to the forty percent. So, uh, expect uh, the fission. What what can we? Uh, learn more from the VSTO attack. 
the VSTO loading, uh, is, as I as I said, the first uh, uh, the first step, uh, the office will check the registry, and then uh, the application will load the Dell. The Dell is load the other Dell, and uh, the other Dell uh, will load the uh, add-ins or the template or the extension to execute the code your co or, or or your command you want. And uh, and then uh, the uh, uh, the office application will check the uh, 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 will check uh, will, will will do some security uh, security check. Uh, just uh, uh, for example, the documentation is legal or illegal, uh, and and so on. And this is the whole uh, VSTO loading process. From this, we can see VSTO. The whole process is also uh, include the CLR extension, uh, CLR execution. So the CLR attacking surface is worked on this uh, surface. So since uh, since the VST documentation will hosted by the CLR. So we can do the same things in CRR, and we can do the same thing in the VSTO. So uh, there's a question. Uh, can we find more bugs from this idea? Uh, the answer is yes. Uh, we <laughs> uh, create a mod, uh, mod uh, for, uh, we create a fuzzy mod uh and uh, uh to uh, the 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 ideas is the uh, first uh .NET framework include CRR and C sharp code well translated by CRR and uh, we so we can just uh, fuzz the uh IL code by the MS IL injection easier and uh, we control the, the IL code, and then we control the uh, .NET uh, application program flow. We just uh, we, we we just need to control the IL code, and we just uh, we just can control the program. Uh, we can control the application, and this is uh, our uh, fast uh, fast mode. Uh, in this situation, uh, in this fuzzing situation, uh, the uh, MSI injection plan B, just uh, proposed by the uh, Frag uh, magazine, is better. So uh, we do some uh, fuzzing test. And uh, there is a simple code uh, which we can invoke the, our defined code. Uh, this is just uh, like a uh, temper templar template. Oh, uh, this part refers to the frog paper, and uh, I just need to uh, fuzz the DL or fuzz the IL code. So uh, let's see. Uh, for example, we choose the pitch, pitch fuzzy to do this work. Uh, I uh, wrote a pitch fuzzing template to, uh, in, in, in this following image, you can see I just uh, uh, change the dial or change the IL code. And this is a uh, wrong result uh, with the pitch. And, uh, 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 lucky, uh, we just uh, do this work one day, and we got the uh, office crash. But and uh, uh, we also locate the reason. Uh, it is a logic bug. Uh, it is a logic bug uh, when office search the uh, when office opening and uh, search the target uh, uh, and search the tag in the registry. Uh, I I consider it's it's uh, it's not a, a low hanging fruit exploit, but 
uh, I have not uh, submit this report to the Microsoft, so I can't, I can't uh, see this clearly here. And uh, uh, so, sorry, guys, uh, um, let you hear our rubbish spoken English. <laughs> Uh, this is my acknowledgement. Uh, the first uh, we will, uh, thanks to the Frog magazine author, uh, Anthony. And uh, I will also thank my boss, the YG07. And, uh, and the, the last uh, the killing team is our, is our some underground hacker. And uh, this is a link for the Frogger magazine. Okay. Questions? All right. Before we op before we adjourn to the break for your lunch, which everyone is eagerly to go for, any questions for the gentlemen over here? I will be the translator, so don't worry. I will try to translate what you mean <laughs> to him, what you want to say to you. Any questions? All right. Thank you very much.